Eco Nirvana Sulo is one of the world's leading suppliers of waste management technology now making a grand entrance to the Indian subcontinent. Headquartered in Germany and Dubai, Eco Nirvana Sulo brings over 116 years of experience in the design, engineering and manufacture of world-class waste container systems. Our strong clientele includes leading municipalities around the world, the largest of multinational corporations and iconic real estate projects such as Burj Dubai, the world's tallest tower, and Dubai Mall, the world's largest shopping arcade. With world-class German engineering, highest level of quality, long-term durability and economical pricing, we wish to bring you Sulo Mobile Container Systems. Sulo first designed and patented the two-wheel and four-wheel containers back in 1972, and they are fondly called Sulo bins in almost all parts of Europe, Australia, and the Middle East. The highest class and material of these products remain unmatched around the world. To warrant this, Sulo Mobile Garbage Containers have been awarded the highest rating by the AWB RAL Quality Certification Authorities of Germany. The procedure conducted for this rating includes very harsh mechanical tests, dropping completely filled containers from a height of 3 meters, temperature tests from a highest of 95 degrees Celsius to a lowest of minus 18 degrees Celsius. Also, maneuverability and user-friendly tests. Sulo has outclassed every other bin in the market in all these tests and remains number one in the world. Hence, our guarantee that no bin in the current market can match our Sulo bins. In the following video, we will show you some of the most critical tests conducted live by industry test professionals from RAL and AWB Quality Assessment Authorities. The RAL AWB Quality Certification Tests begin from the instant the raw material enters the factory at Herford, Germany. All Sulo bins are 100% made in Germany at our state-of-the-art facility at Herford, Germany and nowhere else. With a single production facility, with our in-house research and development department, we can maintain the highest quality of our products with constant monitoring and enhancement. Here, the plastic granules are bought into the factory by the vehicle and before offloading a small sample of the granules is taken for raw material quality testing. This test is done before delivery acceptance to make sure that the HDPE granule supplier's quality is up to the mark. The quality test starts with the melt flow index. This is an industrial quality control parameter. Ultraviolet or UV stabilization is an extremely important part of the manufacturing process. Though expensive, UV stabilization makes sure the bin is equipped to handle direct sunlight and external exposure without any consequences. The benefits are significant in terms of aging and durability of the product. The next test is the density test. Here, a small volume of the HDPE granules are injection molded on the spot to obtain a small molded sample piece for density testing. Measuring the weight of an injection molded polymer sample in air and in methanol to determine its purity. Only after the raw material testing is completed successfully, the vehicle is allowed to offload the material into the factory raw material silos. The appearance and workmanship tests make sure that all Sulo bins that leave the factory are devoid of any fault or uneven thickness. This explains the smooth finish and luster of every Sulo bin. All corners and edges are thoroughly inspected, including the lid reinforcements and rims. In advanced waste collection procedures, electronic chips form a crucial part of the bin collection system. 
All Sulo bins are designed and manufactured with a chip nest so that the electronic identification chips may be incorporated wherever necessary. Hence, any upmarket developments that are interested in implementing the electronic chip system can partner with Sulo. These electronic chips can keep a complete track of weight of the waste collected, frequency of collection, and other details as required. The RAL and AWB certification also requires a range of temperature tests under extreme conditions to examine the strength and durability of the bins. Please note that no other testing standard has these detailed procedures. The warm storage test is one of the many extreme temperature tests. The bin is kept under conditions of 95 degrees Celsius temperature for three days and any changes in dimensions are studied. As you can note in this case, the bin shows almost no variation in height, width or length despite the 95 degrees Celsius exposure for over 72 hours. Even the frontal receiver, whose strength is essential in case of an AFNOR lifting system, shows close to no signs of expansion. This is a very important factor for all cities which have to deal with harsh summers and strong sunlight every year for long months. Trust us, the Sulo bin is designed to handle these conditions and a lot more. Non-RAL AWB certified bins often show no uniformity in their weights because there are no tests to govern this factor. All RAL AWB certified bins like Sulo on the other hand show close to no variation in the mass of their bodies. The ball drop test is another crucial test of the RAL AWB series. Here the lid, hinge and the bottom of the Sulo bin is exposed to harsh testing under extreme conditions of minus 18 degrees Celsius. As you are aware, plastic is weakest when it is frozen and brittle. Hence the extreme temperature of this testing to study the real strength of the bin. Here, a 5 kg ball is dropped from a height on every critical part of the bin such as the edge of the lid rim, the edges of the hinge, the middle of the hinge and the edges of the bottom of the bin. Please note that these are all the most sensitive parts of the bin which undergo a lot of strain. As you may know from experience, these are the parts which are exposed to the most stress and break easily. Hence, it is important for these areas to be very strong in composure. The Sulo bin under these extreme conditions is completely solid. Now, let's observe the effect of the ball drop test on a non-RAL AWB certified bin. This bin has also been kept under minus 18 degrees Celsius and will be examined by the same 5 kg ball. Observe carefully, within the second ball drop on the middle of the hinge, the left edge has completely cracked. Now, observe the bottom of the bin it completely shatters on first impact, the shattered hinge and the shattered bottom. Now for a closer look, there's a complete crack through the center of the bin, deep and wide. Please note carefully that any of these damages will render the bin completely useless to you. You can't do anything else but get rid of it a substandard bin that is not RAL AWB certified never delivers. The drop test is the most dramatic of all RAL AWB tests but also the most widely acknowledged and respected. This test shows the true strength of the bin, examines the engineering that has gone into its production and highlights its durability under heavy stress usage. In the four-wheel category, the Sulo MGB-1100L bin is dropped four times with a weight of 350 kilograms from a height of 2.5 meters. Under these conditions, 
a non-RAL AWB certified bin would be severely damaged with a shattered bottom. But the Sulo bin is absolutely intact with no harm done. Now, for the favorite drop test of the Sulo MGB240L. Dropped four times, three times straight down and the fourth time at an angle. Loaded with 96 kilograms and dropped from a height of three meters. Ready? Go! Drop one, no problem. Drop two, still intact and inclined. Drop four, incredibly strong. Now for a non-RAL AWB certified bin. Like so many in the market, the first drop with 96 kilograms from a height of 3 meters. The non-RAL AWB certified bin is damaged on the very first impact. A very common problem with the non-RAL AWB certified bin. A completely shattered base. This makes the bin completely useless and you are left with no option but to dispose of it. Now you know why to go with Sulo. This is the surfactant test. The bottom of the bin is kept in an emulsion of surfactant liquid for 48 hours at a temperature of 70 degrees Celsius. The bottom is then studied for any variation in rigidity, appearance of cracks, and general condition. The inclined plane impact test. With a load of 350 kilograms, the bin is rolled down an incline of approximately 30 degrees to study the strength and durability of the wheels. The loaded bin is only stopped at the wheels and nowhere else. Hence, there is maximum pressure on the wheels as well as the bin bottom where the wheels are attached to the base. This shows how effectively the Sulo bin is designed with adequate reinforcements to take this kind of harsh impact. The Sulo bin comes out with flying colors. The Sulo bin body and the wheels are more than capable of handling these extraordinary tests. The curbstone drop test is one of the most rigorous tests in the RAL AWB series. Here, the four-wheel Sulo bin is subjected to a drop of 140 millimeters, the approximate height of the pavement or footpath for 1,000 times. This tests the real resilience of the wheels and shows how much impact they can take. This test is ideal for India due to the harsh conditions of our roads and everyday usage. Only RAL AWB compliance allows the bins to survive this test. Here's the curbstone drop test for the two-wheel Sulo bin. The Sulo bin is dropped from a height of 200 millimeters, the approximate height of the curb for 1,000 times. As you can see, the impact resistance of the Sulo bin is tested to the extreme under these conditions but Sulo still delivers. The quality of our bins speaks for itself. A non-RALAWB certified bin would not be able to survive this test. The independent wheel test, also called the four-wheel guide roll test. A load of 65 kilograms is placed on the wheels of a four-wheel container independently and the wheels are made to run for 20 kilometers non-stop with false obstructions to subject the wheels to maximum impact. This will truly test their toughness. A similar independent wheel test is conducted on the wheels of the two-wheel container. The wheels are made to run for 5 kilometers non-stop with a weight of 60 kilograms. This setup is also complete with false obstructions to mimic everyday harsh usage similar to our Indian road conditions. Needless to say, the wheels of Sulo bins deliver successfully on both tests, unlike other non-RAL AWB certified bins. Another crucial test is the brake test. 
All Sulo four-wheel containers come with brakes and these brakes are tested to the most extreme extent to make sure they will always deliver. In this case, a load of 350 kilograms is placed in a four-wheel Sulo bin and the brakes on its wheels are tested on an inclined plane at an approximately 30 degree angle. The brakes do their job perfectly. Good quality lies in consistency and with Sulo, you know you can never go wrong. Volume Testing This test of the RAL AWB series gauges the accuracy of the volume of each Sulo bin. Non-RAL AWB certified bins may not always have the volume that they claim to have. But with Sulo, you can rest assured that you are getting what you asked for. Our accuracy on volume on all Sulo bins is tested and certified. The expansion angle test is another critical test of the RAL AWB series. Here, the Sulo bin is at an extreme of minus 18 degrees Celsius temperature conditions. The rim of the lid is subjected to an expansion test to study its strength under such harsh conditions. This guarantees that your Sulo bin will be strong and sturdy during your regular emptying cycles, lasting you for a long time and giving you more than your money's worth. Unlike other non-RAL AWB certified bins, Sulo bins are much more economical in the long term, easier to use, and much more appreciated. Sulo has the highest rating of all RAL AWB certified bins in the world, making us essentially number one. Hence, our guarantee that no bin in the current market can match Sulo. With world-class German engineering, highest level of quality, long-term durability, and economical pricing, we bring you Sulo Mobile Container Systems. Sulo, a leading brand in over 88 countries, is now available across India. All two-wheel and four-wheel models in up to six different colors, red, blue, green, yellow, brown, and charcoal gray. The high quality and reliability of Sulo bins are the need of the hour for all kinds of enterprises in the Indian subcontinent. Our civic and urban infrastructure bodies, private institutions, corporate bodies, and other professional organizations around the country are already seeing the immediate benefits of the very practical and completely functional number one Sulo container system. Today, undoubtedly, Sulo is the benchmark for industry. With our forays into the regional market, we sincerely seek an opportunity to partner with you in bringing our strong expertise and knowledge in this product line. We wish for a strong and mutually beneficial long-term relationship. And if you wish to share our passion for Sulo, please feel free to contact us at any of the contact details furnished in this video. For more details, please visit us at www.econirvana.in and www.sulo.com.